Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, and if you're new, welcome to my channel. So for today's video, I'm actually going to be starting a new series, I guess, on my channel. And it's basically a lookbook. So I will be transforming some characters from my favorite cartoons, animes, even TV shows, and just kind of turn into a, like, a lookbook. So if you're into these things, let me know. And that's basically the gist of this video. So for today's video, we're going to be doing the My Hero Academia collection. This is mostly just the students. If you guys want a villains or probably a um, pro heroes, I guess just let me know. And yeah, I hope you like this video. All right, so starting off with Deku's, as you can see, I gave them like a short kind of bob curly hairstyle because it matches a lot of like his spiky hair and then i gave them a white shirt because throughout the show you see him wearing like a white shirt i didn't really have a green shirt to make it work out and then i finished it off with green cargo pants because it kind of matches the aesthetic of his costume next we have todoroki i gave them a quarter zip it's red blue and white so it kind of reflects on his colors i put my hair into two separate like bangs to kind of see like the vision of his hair i wish i had his wig I don't have that, not yet, but yeah, another really casual look. Now for Tanya Ida's outfit. Honestly, this is one of my all-time favorites because the color coordination is down, the formality of the outfit is down, the style reflecting him is all down, got the glasses, the bangs, it's just, oh, I just love this one so much. Now for Katsuki Bakugo, another one of my favorites. I put on the blonde hair to reflect his, an orange shirt to kind of match his aesthetic as well with the black pants, and just like a hat to top it off. I also gave myself like a chain and also my earrings to really bring out like the gangster style out of me for like this Bakugo look, and I love it. Now for Kirishima's, very casual, very, very casual. I just put in a red crop top. This would work with black pants, black tights, and then just uh, red highlights in my wig and yeah now for denkies um i feel like you can go as crazy as you want with this i just didn't have all the accessories or like the clothes or cloth pieces for this i was thinking more like you have the yellow shirt for example my tube top and then i gave him like a nice black jacket and then this would look all very very nice with like black pants with chains and even like uh platform boots i would say and you know just experiment now for Sero's outfit. Sero's outfit is pretty simple as well. I gave him a turtleneck to reflect on his costume. It could be a white turtleneck, it could be a black turtleneck, and then just black pants, a white hat, and the hair to match his style. And yeah. Now for Jiro's. Oh, I really, really love this. I feel like I can go outside and just wear this and just be Jiro as long as I want. I gave her a panic at the disco shirt to reflect her taste in music and because it was purple it really helped with the aesthetic. I put on my headphones and I just love this. The hair as well. Ugh, love it. Now to quickly talk about Urara cause it's one of my all-time favorites as well cause the hairstyle matches hers. I gave her a pink uh, large sweatshirt to match her bubbly personality and I just really like this one. And now for Momo's nice elegant outfit. This one you can go any way you want. As you can see, I parted my hair in the middle just like she would in the ponytail. Or you can leave it all down and still have that elegant style. Have the red dress to match her costume colors. And you know, just go crazy. Last but not least, we have Mina in her very, very nice outfit. It's pretty simple. You got the pink hair just like hers and then the pink shirt to reflect her color. And I went with red jeans to kind of reflect on like the polka dot style in her costume. So like, you know, kind of like holes. And it was, it's just cute. And that is the end of my video. I really, really hope you guys liked it. I had a lot of fun making this one. I'm not even going to lie. And I'm looking forward to making a lot more because I have a lot more in mind. And I am aware that I am missing a couple of students. So if you'd like to see a part two, the rest of the students, let me know. And yeah, with that, I will see you all in my next video. Bye, guys.